Hey, welcome to my channel. Well, in this video, I want to show you a product that is not a drone. Yes, I know it's not a drone and this is a drone channel, but I want to show you this because it applies to you as it does to me. So all of us right now are watching this video on either a phone, a tablet, or your home computer or your television set. If you're watching this on your home computer, well, then you have a big display monitor like I have in the back, probably larger than mine because mine's not that big. And you probably get eye fatigue. Now, for a guy like me, when I edit all these videos, I sit there and I read product information and then I type it into the video and my eyes get a little bit tired. So I need a light, but I need a light that doesn't mess up my screen monitor. So right now I have a product on the monitor behind me that is exactly that. Check this out. So up here, look at my hand. It's lit up. It lights up my hand. It's right on top of my monitor and it shoots the light all the way down onto my laptop. But notice the screens are not messed up at all. And you want to see how bright it is? Watch this. Here's the control panel. I'll push it. And there we go. It's off. But look at the screens still the same and it's back on. And I can adjust the setting with this little button. It will look at the lighting in the room here and it will set the lighting accordingly. That is pretty sweet. And of course I could just spin it here and dial it any to any setting I want. You can set the color temperature and all these other great things. And best of all, it runs on your USB cable. So you don't plug it in the wall. All right, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you, this is the product here. That's the box. I'm gonna show you an unboxing and then I'll show you me using it. And now a quick unboxing of this BenQ screen bar plus e-reading lamp, which I think is gonna be pretty cool. I've never tried one of these. Here's the back of the box. You can see it's got the instructions and it just fits on top of your uh, monitor so that you can actually see items below it without messing up your screen. Let's see what's in the box. So inside we have some, what appears to be instructions or warranty card. It's written in a language I cannot read. Ah, that's better. Here's a few English instructions, how to use the little auto dimmer and the power dial and all the other brightness adjustments. Let's see what it feels like. Whoa, that's got some nice weight to it. That is made out of sort of like metal and some plastic. And the cable running off this split it's into two USBs. So you'll have one that gets power and the other one's gonna go through the actual light. Next in the box is this holder. Wow, this is heavy. This has a lot of weight to it. So it's a counterbalance for the light. The light would fit in here and this would be a counterbalance to fit on top of your uh, display. A little bit of foam. And finally, the light itself. There it is. It's just LED lights in the bottom. You can see them right there. It's in a piece of plastic. It's made out of like a uh, aluminum on top. That's where you plug your little USB in and uh, very nice design. This here movable section is what goes on your actual monitor and it has a bit of weight to it, which is really good. And uh, you can see that you could fit, let's see, you could probably fit a monitor this size from there to there. And then uh, you just put your light bar up here and uh, this just sits on your monitor like this. This is the control panel and it receives its power from this little USB cable that I have plugged into my laptop. To turn the control panel on, push it. There we go. It's automatically going to set itself for the correct brightness. If I had more lights on in the room or less lights on in the room, it would adjust itself. And if you change lights while it's on, you just press this button and it resets itself. Now this little LED is the brightness LED. So I can increase the brightness if I want it to be brighter by turning this dial or I can turn the brightness down. And if I wish to reset it back to the lighting in the room, I just press this button and it will readjust itself. This light over here is selected by pressing this little button. That's my color temperature. Say I want the temperature to be colder. So I would turn this to the right. Now the temperature is colder. And if I want the temperature warmer, I turn it to the left. And at the same time, I can hit it again and go with the brightness and increase the warm to full blast or, or change it back to color temperature and put it on full cold and then reset everything. Now, isn't that a cool product? It's so applicable to things I do, and I'm sure yourself, if you do a lot of stuff on your computer, it applies to you as well. Matter of fact, this is one of the few products that was sent to me for free. I don't get a lot of products for free, but this is one of the ones sent to me for free to review that I liked it so much that I actually bought a second one with my own money so that I can use it on my computer upstairs because I have the same issue. So if you enjoyed this as much as I did, well, I have a link below to where you can find it on Amazon. Check out the prices. They're all over the map, so you'll find it at whatever price price and uh, see if it's something that's for you. All right. See you in the next video when we get back to drones. Take care.